the Spalding NBA Breakaway 180 hoop. This thing is massive. This is the biggest over-the-door hoop that they make. It's actually bigger than the Skills Pro Mini XL hoops by at least a few inches. It's 28 by 16 inches. It's going to be huge. It's going to take up most of the door, which is awesome for inside play. As close as you can get in authenticity to the real thing inside your home. Pretty cool. So mini replica of the NBA backboard, the official one. 180 degree breakaway rim, just like the actual NBA one. Pretty cool. Comes with a five inch rubber ball, very authentic and nice, which they also have on the smaller ones. Let's turn it over. <laughs> this thing is huge. So nothing they didn't tell us on the front. It's got foam padding, whatever. 180 degree breakaway rim. It's gonna be huge. So let me open this thing. Actually really excited for this one. This is probably gonna be my main hoop since it's so big and awesome compared to the other ones. Pretty excited. So I got this at Academy Sports and Outdoors. I think it was like 60 bucks or so. And they sell them online as well, but I just got it at the local Academy Sports store. There's the five inch ball that we'll have to inflate. Instructions, it's very basic. You know, you got three screws and bolts that you stick the rim to the backboard and then you attach your net, hang it over the door, you're good to go. Here's our rim, screws and bolts, and net, backboard attachment piece. <laughs> and just a massive backboard. <laughs> yeah, this thing is going to look really good on the door, on the wall. You can also mount it these three little points right here. You can take these out and then put screws into your wall if you don't want to hang it over the door. Pretty cool though, so I'm going to put this together and play on it a little bit and I'll tell you how I like it. The Spalding NBA Breakaway 180 is together. Played on it for a little bit, very nice. However, I don't see a springy type thing in here to dunk on it with, so I would be very careful with the dunks not to slam and end up breaking this. It does have a warning, as they all typically do. Don't hang on the rim. That goes for any rim, but I would be happier if it had some kind of spring assembly type thing in there like these smaller versions do. Now that the sucker doesn't snap, it's a beautiful backboard. This is just massive, 28 by 16. I'll put it next to their standard version. See the difference? That's the standard size mini hoop right there versus the breakaway hoop, which is basically a, their XL version, but this is the biggest indoors over the door hoop you can buy. It's a lot of fun to play on, a lot of fun to shoot hoops. However, I would not dunk on this. You can already tell that the weight of this is pulling on the inside of the board and it's just waiting to snap right there. Great over the door hoop, but I would say it's delicate and to be careful with it. If you do snap it in half, you could probably get a super glue or an epoxy and put it back together carefully with some Loctite or something like that, but I would be very careful. The ball itself, very grippy, very nice. Very authentic, An authentic looking board looks great in your home, man cave, office, etc. Makes a great gift. I wish it was more springy in this area here. I'm starting to wonder. Maybe I can take the rim off this one and stick it in here somehow. I might be able to rig something up. 
because I like the backboard. I love this backboard. Looks awesome. Good foam padding if you want to quiet it down. Put a towel underneath the top right there, some more rubber. Now you don't have to hang it over a door. As with most of these, you can pop these out. And right here, put some screws in there to your door, to your wood frames on the wall or whatever, and uh, you're good to go. But I was shooting some hoops on here, a lot of fun. Nice rim. I do think it's going to be a little delicate though, and I don't want to snap this thing easily because it's so huge, and I just see that weak point right there waiting to snap. So if you do get this, I'd be careful. I wish they would make a 2.0 version of this with some improvements, like a good little spring assembly in there, maybe a thicker board, and something to stabilize it because it's huge. But um, I could see this snapping if you're not careful. So buy it with discretion. It's not cheap, but it looks awesome. And I think if you're careful with it, it'll last you a while. Just be very careful not to dunk too hard on this thing, and you should be good to go. Spalding NBA Breakaway 180 hoop. This thing is massive. This is the biggest over-the-door hoop that they make. It's actually bigger than these skills.